Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to show the electron configuration of nitrogen and oxygen. And I'll be using the diagonal rule. First, I'll write my 1s orbitals, 1 to 7, then my p orbitals, 2 to 7, then the d orbitals, then the f orbitals. Also, the s orbitals can hold up to 2 electrons. The P can hold up to 6, the D can hold up to 10, and the F can hold up to 14. And a good way to remember it is that it goes up by 4 each time. So now let's take a look at nitrogen. First we need to figure out how many electrons nitrogen has. And it has an atomic number of 7, so it has 7 electrons. So I will start at 1s. So I, S can take up to two electrons, so it will be 1s2. Then I go to 2s, and that will be 2s2. So I've used four electrons, and then we have 2p3. And you can write it in shorthand using the noble gas, and here's what that looks like. Next, let's look at oxygen. Oxygen has an atomic number of eight, so it has eight electrons. So we will fill up 1s first, so that will be 1s2, then 2s2. Next we go to 2p, and we've already used up two of the elect excuse me, four of the electrons, so it will be 2p4. And if you write it using the noble gas, here's what it looks like. So there we go. I hope that helps in writing the electron configuration of nitrogen and oxygen. Thanks for watching. And Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.